hi everyone welcome to my youtube channel in this video i am going to explain you about the experiment on males apertus so here is the experimental setup for this experiment so in this experiment we have to verify the vibrating string using males apertus so first let us know how to make the connect so the apertus required for this experiment so this is the tuning fork you can see and this experiment is made for verifying the longitudinal mode of vibrations okay so if you keep this tuning fork vertical then you can verify the longitudinal modes and if you keep this tuning fork horizontal you can uh, change the position by using this knob and you can keep it in horizontal mode so then you can verify for transverse mode so this is the arrangement for longitudinal mode so the apparatus required as i said tuning fork and this is the electromagnet and here is the screw to produce spark and here are the two terminals we have to connect it to the transformer this is the step down transformer which is having the voltage range of about 0 to 12 volt and here are the weights so here we have weights up to 100 gram and here is the pulley where uh, we have to hang this weight pan okay and here we require the thread Sh we should connect this thread across this pulley where we have attached the weight pan and then uh, we should connect it to this screw by uh, to the tuning fork so this is all about the arrangement for this experiment so let us take here the weight of about 10 gram so this is 10 gram i am going to keep it in the weight pan so after putting the weight in the weight pan so next what we have to do here so switch on the step down transformer and you have to apply the voltage between this range so let us keep it at 4 and use this knob to produce spark you can uh, uh, observe the vibration or you can hear the voice it make noise so i have increased the voltage 4 to 6 so it will produce the vibrations in the string or the wire so you will get the modes so you must get the loops here number of loops you should note down for the applied weight so uh, let us wait so that the loops has been produced so you can make this screw so you can hear the voice so it will make noise when you use this to to produce this spark so it is going to create the loop in this string the number of loops you should note down
for that we should measure the length of this uh, string or the wire using uh, this scale so once the number of loops are produced for the applied weight note down the values in the tabular column this is the tabular column for longitudinal mode mass in the pan tension in the string that is given by mass into acceleration due to gravity g is equal to 9.8 meter per second square or you can convert in terms of cgs uh, so 980 dynes you can take uh, so here if you multiply mass into acceleration due to gravity tension capital t you will get for the applied weight so weights are in terms of gram 1 5 and 10 gram so i, I have applied uh, here 10 gram for that you can calculate so the number of loops produced for 1 gram 6 and for uh, 5 gram 5 10 gram 4 number of loops produced so wavelength you can calculate so once you calculate wavelength square of that divided by tension in the string you have to calculate